Made the LRT Katipunam, so I'm going to take the LRT train to Recto, Manila. So I'm in Manila now, so I took a jeepney to the Visoria Mall. I'm in the jeepney and on my way to the Visoria Mall. I'm just looking out the window, I try my best not to get people's faces in my videos. If your face appears in mine, I'm so sorry. There are other malls where people shop at, but I've always heard of the Fisoria and I want to go there. So I asked the jeepney driver, like, oh, I'm going to the Fisoria mall, please let me know when I get there so I don't miss it. Yep, I'm here. So the mall has many streets around it and the streets have been blocked by sellers on the outside selling their wares. There are lots of things to buy. I actually like it when sellers put their prices and you can still haggle you know, based on whatever price is put there, like you know, beat them a bit lower. But I wanted to get into the mall and it's a bit down. So I have to walk all the way down. This car, this um, truck trying to pass here reminds me of Lagos Island Market and Lagos Balogu Market. The roads will be so narrow, full of people and people selling stuff and cars want to pass. Yeah. So I have to find a corner to go through. There are so many things to buy, so many things to see. I haven't even gotten to the mall itself. So many things on the outside. The green building down there as I'm headed. So many people. Okay, I went on a public holiday. I was thinking on a public holiday, yeah, there won't be much people who will be celebrating at home. Voila. It was full of people. I think this this was around eight in the morning. Mm -hmm. Bustling with life. I love markets. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's the mall, the Visoria Mall. So my plan is to go into the mall and see what they do. I've heard so much about the Fisoria Mall, even when I was in Nigeria, when I was Googling about the Philippines. No. So, yep, I'm heading in. I could, the mall is air-conditioned. Yep, air-conditioned. And there were lots of people. I stopped by this one. They had some things. They were having some sales for clothes. They had everything clothes, lingerie, trousers, so many things, so many things. So I was just checking. And the prices were affordable, you know, they were good. I tried to haggle, but Lido was like, it's already a, a seal, so it's fixed. I was like, okay. Yeah, but the prices were okay. It made sense. Yeah, because normally I buy things via 
Lazada, Shopee, or I go to SM North, they like nails clothing stores in SM North and in UP Town Center. And we have some brand shops there. So this was nice, it was a very good experience. Like what? I think it's actually better because I'm 5'8 and pardon me more. It's hard to find things that are actually my length when it comes to trousers, skirts, dresses because um, most people in the Philippines are, you know, average height maybe 5.0 or below. I know someone is actually 4.7, 4 feet 7 inches. Like people are, yeah. So it's length, length of things are always hard for me. It's always hard to find my length. And yeah, most times when I order things via Lazada or Shopee, I have to return them. I need to go to Uniqlo or um, Terra Nova or what's this other shop in UP Town Center. Okay, my height. So I was done shopping there, I said to walk around. I like I didn't have a particular thing in mind. Oh, this was so cute. I thought about getting it for my goddaughter, but I was like, I'll come back. So many things to see. This is just the ground floor, as in the first floor. Yeah, I saw an escalator. There are other floors because the building is tall. So I didn't have a particular thing in mind to buy. I like, didn't just see what the market is about. You know and see if you know i can buy anything or something i like so i'm just walking around most shops have prizes yeah blankets for 120 pesos oh in case you're wondering about the prizes it's in pesos philippine pesos yeah that's the escalator this is the next floor So I kept walking around, trying my best not to get people's faces because I don't like being in someone's video without permission, so I wouldn't do that to someone else. I saw 20 pesos each, I was like glasses really <laughs> i checked but i didn't see anything glasses or any glasses that i liked yeah this they had a whole lot of other glasses for different prices but i just wanted to check the bagging Jade pearls and gold. Well, let's just say I didn't see any black person in this market today. <laughs> so, yeah, that was the only one I saw. I wanted to buy some vegetable fruits, dried vegetables, yeah, vegetable crisps. But the seller was so busy, there were lots of people, and I made a mental note, so I'll come back, I'll come back, and I left. It's rainy season, get your umbrella. 
Well, in the Philippines, umbrellas like a fixture. When it's raining, when the sun is out, everyone has their umbrellas. You know, irrespective of the weather. Protect your skin. I think they had so many things. There were sections, people were just sending school bags, umbrellas, kids' books, kids' toys, clothes, shoes, accessories. Oh, so many things. I love going to markets, so this was, I loved it. I think I went to the same place twice because I was just walking around. The place was huge and there were so many rows and aisles. Like you're walking on the main row or aisle, then the other ones by the sides to get into. I got lost once or twice. <laughs> or I went to the same place once or twice. Like, oh, I've been here before. Like, hmm, okay, spots where then the sports prayers were new, two for 150 pesos. Like, hmm, let's see. And it meant I made a mental note that I was going to come back. I just wanted to see what was in there. I told the lady I'll be back. I guess many people say that, but never come back. But I did. Yeah. And like, if I get less, let me just get to the next floor. So it's be a later. Let me see what the upstairs have to offer I actually decided to stop videoing after a while because I I hadn't done much shopping and I had a lot of ground to cover so I'm about to stop videoing so thank you for coming with me to the Visoria Mall in Manila the Philippines bye